Here we are with another stage from the 2017 Optics Nationals. This is stage two called Dot Com. It's a 22 round course of fire with 10 paper and two steel. You start standing anywhere inside the shooting area with your wrists below the edge of the belt with your gun unloaded and holstered. And then at the signal, you engage the targets as they become visible. This stage is one of those stages where you could sit there and try to figure out a million different ways to shoot it. You could shoot from right to left, left to right. You could avoid and eliminate positions altogether. And as a general rule of thumb in practical shooting, you want to try to eliminate setups and positions. The only time that you don't want to do that is if the shots become so difficult that you don't get your hits. And then of course your hit vector suffers and you bomb the stage. So this stage was really, really neat. And you could pick literally five different ways to shoot it. As a right-handed shooter, I opted to start on the left side of the shooting area and engage the targets as I saw them flowing to the right side of the range, finishing up with that last steal and disappearing target. Now, the really big question is, because you don't know what it's going to be like when you're actually shooting it, what is that bouncy, bridgey thingy going to feel like? <laughs> Normally, I suggest that people really slow down during their walkthroughs so that they can plan and choreograph exactly what they want to do on the stage. But for this stage in particular, this is when you really want to have at least one run through at speed so you can get an idea of how you need to step onto a prop that is either wobbling or bobbing or anything like that. Generally speaking, I find that I want to have soft knees and try to have a soft landing going into it. I did watch one shooter just really like go gung-ho and launch himself onto that bouncy, bridgey thingy, and uh, <laughs> it was definitely a wobble in for him. This is the time that you can run through at speed so you can get an idea of what it will feel like. Are you ready? Thanks so much for watching the stage breakdown. There's a whole bunch of them in this series with a few more yet to come. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, please do because I'd love to have you as a subscriber. And uh, if you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comments section below. And as I always like to say, be safe and have fun.